my name is Jody Alamer. I'm an independent consultant in municipal governance and city strategy, which is a fancy way of saying that I help people involved in the management of cities and urban development to do a better job of that, to work towards more resilient outcomes for the range of people that live and work and visit our cities. A lot of people think of urban development just as the sort of bricks and mortar, the built environment and that sort of thing. But all of that just shapes how we can interact with one another, how we gain or don't gain access to the economy, to schools, to opportunities to connect with one another, places where we do or don't feel safe, and how we design that and how close people live or don't live to opportunities to one another, to people who are different from one another, impacts on things like social mobility and social inclusion, economic inclusion. All of that you know, has layers of gender and race and age. While we might focus on the bricks and mortar side of it, the social side is very close to it. Urban development is not just a big city phenomenon. It's also happening in rural areas. So even in rural areas, people are moved towards smaller towns and provide pressure on the smaller town to provide for infrastructure and, and housing. So what we see in big cities also exists in smaller cities, just on a slightly different scale. <music> Developer market need, and real estate investor market uh, need to, to broaden their investor framework to, to be focused on shared value. Um, and include social value into their, their investment analysis. The four points that I'm sort of tracking at the moment is around the shift to off-grid infrastructure, not only in energy, but also in, in wastewater and water, and not only at a site scale, but also at a precinct scale. The expectation for who provides for affordable housing, is it uh, government or is it the market or something in between? And, and the different sort of trends in the Western market versus our market, the pendulum swinging in opposite directions. New models for renting and owning, innovation in shorter term rent agreements and financing products where the lenders are partners in the, in the development of rent to buy and build to rent out products. Innovation in commercial uh, renting products where landlords are partners with small businesses to, to help them to scale their businesses or offer shorter term rentals for you know, testing if your business is viable. No individual stakeholder holds all of the resources or mandate to build the city of the future. So act from where you are to make your contribution to building the cities.